teachers in this video I'm going to introduce you to Zoho forms where you can create an online attendance form with virtual signature for your students it is easy to make and practical to use so let's get started so first get into the browser and use the keyword Zoho form or form Zoho then you'll find a page titled online form builder just click on it to get into its website sign up for free for your new account and later on if you have one already you can directly log in next you will see this page and go to the top right to create new form to create a new form you have to first name it and describe it if you want and after that you can start building your form in the builder. The left side is a list of fields to put in your form that you can drag and drop. And the right side is the properties for you to edit and manage the form. Here I give you some samples. Here you can use different kind of fields with different functions. You can edit and manage its name, the choices, the validation, the feasibility, and many others based on what you need. And the signature can be found in advanced fields. Just drag and drop it to your draft. And lastly, if your form is ready, do not forget to save. Right. Before you share the link of this form to your students, you need to set several things first. So let's go to setting, click on acknowledgement, and you can manage whether you want to include a link to allow the respondents to add another response or not. Or you can also edit the thank you page that will show up after the form is submitted. Do not forget to save. After that, it is important to set your time right, so go to the general setting and manage your time zone, based on where you live. After you make this kind of change, do not forget to save. And then the other thing is to set the theme to make your form looks more interesting. There are several choices. The templates given by Zoho, you just choose one that you like best. Now you can go to the access form on top right of this page and then it will direct you to the final form. Try filling it out to find any problems and if it's done, there's no more problem, then you can share it to your students. This is how you make the signature. It's easier using your phone actually. Alright, now if you want to share the link, first go back to the builder page, click on share, and then you will find that there are many different ways to share the link using permalink, hyperlink, or QR code, etc. You can even shorten the URL. Give the link to your students and it's done. Ah, to remind you, the free version of the Zoho form, uh, you can create at most three forms for one account with 200 megabytes file storage and 500 submissions per month. I think that's that. Thank you and hopefully it helps.